my dear friends in jesus christ today we are celebrating the 12th sunday in ordinary time when we look into the holy gospel today we can see jesus coming with storm jesus and his disciples were crossing the galilee sea while they were crossing the galilee sea all of a sudden a storm came a storm of wind got up then and there the disciples were afraid big waves are dashing upon the boat the boat was at the point of being swept of course anyone who was in that storm would be afraid in the same way these disciples were so terrified that they were crying to jesus who was sleeping in the stone of the boat o lord save us we are perishing o lord save us we are perishing then and there jesus got up and commanded the storm be still and there was a great calm then jesus turned to these disciples and said why are you so terrified ask are you of little faith why are you so terrified are you of little faith my dear friends in jesus christ it is natural that when a sudden storm came these disciples were afraid that this storm will destroy completely their whole life but but my dear brothers immediately immediately they understood that jesus was with them in other words when they become aware of the presence of jesus christ among them the storm became a calm there was a great calm a fearless peace entered into their whole life dear friends when we reflect upon this whole incident it gives us a remarkable message to our life the ulterior motivation of this incident is to become aware of the presence of jesus when we look into our whole life all all life we can see in our day to day life we we may come across many problems trials and tribulations hardships they are we cannot bear sometimes we we may be affected affected incurable diseases or else we may be in chaotic situation where we cannot understand we are we are perplexed we are where we are confused with the things that we have our whole life is complicated therefore we are in a chaotic situation therefore the thing is we do not become aware of the presence of jesus therefore we feel that we are left alone of course we are left alone when the terrible things happen in our life there is no one to help us of course when there is no one to help us to come out of this pit of destruction we may we may feel frustrated we may feel left alone but in this holy gospel today we are invited to reflect upon or we are invited to become aware of the presence of jesus with the experience of the disciples we are invited to feel the presence of jesus that jesus is with us then and there our problems are solved the diseases which are incurable will be cured even in a terminal situation in a melancholic situation in our life we feel happy we feel that 
Jesus is with us. Even in the wildest storm of our life, we experience the peace like these disciples experience today. Because Jesus is the one who gives us peace in the storm of sorrow. And Jesus is the one who gives us peace in the storm of anxiety. The, the enemy of peace is worry. Worry for ourselves. Worry about those who, those who love. Worry about those we love. Worry about the unknown future. And also, Jesus is the one who gives us peace when life's problem involves us in the tempest of doubt, uncertainty, tension. My dear friends in Jesus Christ, when we look into, look into this whole incident, we are told that Jesus is with us. Therefore, we need to become aware of the presence of Jesus even among the, even in our life situation. Now see, in a mouth incident, how these two disciples experienced Jesus. While they were going towards a mouse, we can see they experienced Jesus or else, or in other words, once they become aware of the presence of Jesus with them, they turn back to Jerusalem, the center of spirituality. So therefore, let us try to reflect upon this Holy Gospel throughout this week and also try to remember that Jesus is with us always whatever comes to our life whatever happens to our life Jesus is with us, with us we are not left alone we don't want to feel alone and once we become aware of the presence of Jesus in our whole life in every situation of our life our problems are solved even in our chaotic situation we can experience the peace in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.